I wonder how many rejections will it take before anyone quits? For me, probably once or twice, but thank goodness others can hold on like the writer of the Squid Game. My name is Peter, the creator of the hit show Struggle for 10 years to get it made. Hong Dong-yo started writing the series in 2008 and finished the first draft in 2009. It took Hong over 6 months to finish writing the first 2 episodes, but once he got the ball rolling, he knew he had something. And that something turned out to be his biggest struggle to get a studio to produce what will turn out to be a massive hit. You would think that the first studio reading the script would jump aboard the dystopian survival game train. He struggled for 10 years to find a backer so it had to wait on the red light being shot down for such a long period. He wanted to write a fictional story on our modern society with an extreme take of competition of the most desperate competitors that has done wrong to themselves. And his story of his own personal life translated so well into the series, 10 years of struggle to keep it alive. To a point where selling his laptop for $675 to make ends meet, that's knowing the struggle, friends. But he didn't give up, run home and cried. He continued the game. He detoured his way to the green light to make things happen. He placed the series on hold and shifted to create feature films. His creation, whether it was film or series, are more than just to entertain. It's a tug of war of our own despair. If we're really able to look at ourselves from the outside, then it's much easier to see our own faults. With every struggle, there'll be that one moment of opportunity, but don't let it pass by without action. For Hong, it was Netflix who would fund and give creative freedom to allow him to create a masterpiece series that would become a phenomenon. It would become Netflix number one most watched show across 90 countries worldwide, and it's still growing. All those years of struggle, finally paid off. Keep grinding, keep holding on. Someone like Hong after a decade never gave in to rejection. That's the lesson friends. If they can't see what it is now, give it some time and don't lose sight of what you have.